and gentlemen, and you may simply know me as Logamus Prime. Welcome back to yours truly doing the reaction thing to Yuri on Ice. Yeah, well, like certain videos, I'm really louder than others, but man, Yuri on Ice gets me really excited. Uh, just because, oh man, the characters are very likable and hateable at the same time. The last episode was pretty brilliant. I really enjoyed it. Uh, it's weird how I start hating characters and then liking them. Like, yeah, this show's really growing on me. Like, I, I, I'm almost, I feel almost ashamed that this show is animated because it's so brilliant. It, it deserves to be live action. It deserves to have a bigger audience. Another thing that I, I'm now disliking is I, I didn't think that the show was going to go so quick and be like, bam, it's over, you know, you will. We pretty much reached the halfway point of the show. I thought we were going to see Victor and Yuri uh, do techniques and whatnot and see montages and whatnot, whatever. But be it that the show's only 12 episodes long, they did not do any filler. They're like straight to the point. And that's all we're going to get. So now we're getting to the Grand Prix thing. We're getting to the pre-tournament stuff. Shit, things are about to get really real. So, the biggest question of all is, will Yuri, I mean, no, not even, I'm going to have to step back, because the fact is, Yuri can do this, he's made it, he's made it to the finals, he's made it to the big one, he just always chokes at the last one, right? And that, that's the whole point of the show. So even if Victor didn't help him, he still could have done it, he still could win the pre- uh, pre-competition tournament thing. I'm sure he would have done great in, in those. He just needs to do better on the big one. Alright guys, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to watch the episode. I'm going to dissect it. I'm going to commentate. I'm going to react to it. And then by the end of the episode, I give a quick overall opinion of what I just watched and where I think the show is going to go. So without further ado, let's do it. Episode 5 of Yuri and I. Let's go. You know what? I, I'm becoming that guy. Normally, like, I just skip the intros and get to the episode, but... The song is so badass. I, I, I enjoy it so much. I can't find myself to skip it. I want to hear it. My victory. Far to make history. There are four of us in the senior men's division, and I'm the oldest by a lot. Wait, I thought he was the same age as Victor. Oh, I messed up. That's messed up, Yuri. Finally, so today he can take it easy. His focus will be on scoring his personal best. I've told you a million times, but unless you're with Victor for a while now, Honestly, you know, I didn't even think about that. Sure, if my I bet they get constant cold, right? I have to figure out if I'm in good at wouldn't that be cheating? All the skaters get to see their performance before they do it. Oh man, you know what? We didn't even get to see his actual performance, what made him fail. That would have been great. Touche, he's got to look pimp. Coach, it's my duty to send you out there feeling confident. I know it's been tough, but I truly believe that you... Uh... My goal is the grand okay, wow. He didn't even let Victor talk to him. He was, like, focus. <laughs> He's mad. Why does he look so upset? Wait, this whole time I thought it was a dog. It, it's, it's, oh, it's a little fake thing. Oh, they got me. I'm like, why does he have a dog? Oh, I gave him a hug. Oh my god, well, that that feels very like like Seduce me paparazzi. Like you have, and you can bring the whole audience to their knees. That's wow. what I say in practice, right? Right. That is some serious words right there. Remember, I like his little like outfit. It looks pretty cool. You are the femme fatale of the pork cutlet bowl. <laughs> you can do this. I hope he doesn't fail. Maybe this time he doesn't fall. My thing is with double figure skating, right? I mean, how many times can you do the same, on, you know, people, dance thing? Response. Wouldn't the it get boring or something? Like, wouldn't the judges be like, yeah, I already seen this. Right. I am a mouth-watering pork cutlet bowl that no man can refuse. <laughs> wow, Bob's a good man, wow. 
I mean, I, I see the metaphor. Oh, he, he fell again. He, he son of a bitch. Oh, he did it. Well, I think he did his best. <laughs> Ooh, nice finish. Bam. Oh. Wow. He actually has an audience. People are actually rooting for him. <laughs> the first half was great, but then you became so focused on landing the jumps that your performance got sloppy. Right, really like that sort of thing. Right. I mean, that sounds like a coach. Whoa, that, that seems pretty high to me. Only 10 points higher than his official best? That's not much. Let's lower the jump difficulty and focus on performance. Huh? Now, now, you know you've never landed them all in practice. Victor! Early on in the season, it makes sense to lower your program's difficulty. <laughs> then you can adjust as you go. You wouldn't disobey your coach, would you? <laughs> this kid is like what Yuri is when he was a kid, more than likely. Like seeing his idol. Oh, uh, that's pretty cool. I'm hoping I'll be able to. I was being interviewed, so I missed it. Sorry. Aww. <laughs> when your idol sucks. Similar to the one from your famous low grid program. A costume from my shameful past. He's got a super fan, and he doesn't even know. You make fun of yourself. You're also making fun of me for looking up to you all this time. Tomorrow, I'm going to give it everything I've got. And you are Damn, that's a fight. Let's not forget it. Last I'm going to try one too. Seriously? But you've never even landed one in practice. Ooh. Maybe that could be the downfall for that kid to do a move that he doesn't know how to do. So you has got to play it smart. Don't let it get to him. Don't let it get to him. How can you find the strength to motivate yourself? Wow, that's Wow. I don't know how that makes me feel right there. Talk Victor's being a hypocrite. I mean, he couldn't even keep his promise to Yurio. How can you talk about motivating people who are inspired by you? When you forget to keep your promises. What are you doing? Just like shout. There you go. There you go. That's what I thought he was gonna do. I'm I'm glad he Good did that. <laughs> well, we're actually gonna see um, the performance. Ooh, nailed that move. Wow, is he going to land all of them? Uh oh. Oh no. It's messed up. I wonder if Yuri's gonna keep, um, like, do the same thing Victor did and, like, keep a promise for him. He's got Maybe help him. To be a real... Wow. What's wrong with Yuri? I don't get it. To yell it? Is he doubting himself again? <laughs> Damn, I, I can only imagine what Yuri's gonna do, because at this point, this kid's kicking ass. By their cheers, that you are the star on the stage. No, man, you're doing it again. Yuri's giving up on himself. Come on, 214. <laughs> it's like, right, we don't have to see the token other oh, ice skaters. <laughs> Oh, this, this kid is awesome. Freaking the opposite of Yuri. <laughs> what the hell was that? Why did you hit that kid? Good. I 
think this costume was the right choice. You oh, look, he's, he's wearing the outfit that the kid liked. Aww. That's cute. <laughs> oh, man. What the hell kind of hug is that? <laughs> Career. Oh, here we go. Here comes the main event. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Wait, he's going to pull up the big one? The opening of the PC. Oh, that's pretty. Completely ignoring the fact that I told him to focus on refining the program instead of getting. Victor's not happy. He's like, why are you changing the thing that I taught you? To do before you fail. No, but I think he's got it. He feels very inspired. Come on, buddy. Oh, he failed again. I was right. He did revert the program to having three quads. He doesn't want to look. Good, a triple axel. Good, he hung in there. You can just sense the love. Ooh. I thought he was gonna fall for a sec there. Oh. Damn, man, like Victor's like mesmerized. That's your protege, buddy. Here it comes. Yuri, I told you to make the last jump a triple for the points. <laughs> Most skaters wouldn't rebel against their coach like he has today. I wonder who he takes after. We're just gonna glance over him hitting a wall? <laughs> what the fuck? I guess that would be me. <laughs> Yoko That's a performance you can be proud of! <laughs> I don't get it. He made mistakes. Wasn't the best thing ever. I mean, you gotta be modest. I don't get it. I don't understand ice skating. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Now the score is for Yuri Kuski. Better next time. So he scored pretty good. That's pretty cute. I don't understand how he beat him, though. I mean, he didn't do that good. I don't. I don't understand the scoring system in figure skating. That's crazy. I actually had fun skating in a competition. I don't think that's ever happened before. Well, it's the first time ever he had fun ice skating. What's wrong with you? Ha! <laughs> Yuri, you're gonna kick his ass. Don't worry. I got so much faith in you, buddy. Don't worry about it. will be the next leader of men's singles in Japan. Katsuki, if you will. It was hard, but in the end, I chose love. There have been so many people who have helped me in my competitive skating career. Oh. But since Victor came into my life and became my coach, I've started seeing things differently. It encompasses my relationships with Victor, my family, and my hometown. Okay. It took a long time, but I finally realized I'm surrounded by love every day. This time, there's somebody I want to hold on to. That person is Victor. I don't really have a name for that emotion, but I've decided to call it love. It's changed me. I'm stronger now. And I'll prove it at the Grand Prix Final with a gold medal! <laughs> wow. We're abstract. What does that even mean? <laughs> That's what we get. The first thing we're going to do when he gets back here is burn that necktie. It's tedious. He <laughs> needs a new one before the cup of chai. That was a good episode. Still, I don't understand how Yuri beat that little kid. I mean, he... he fell like twice or three times and he hit it he, he hit a wall i don't i don't get it but the biggest thing that happened in the episode is is um 
I'm not really sure how to describe this as well, but uh, I, just, I, I can't describe Yuri as a loner. Maybe I, I can't really recall that. Maybe he's just a person. He, he described it perfectly. Like, I think he's just a person that had great people in his life, uh, but just never really noticed it or, or like... I don't know, acknowledged it. I don't know how to describe this. Ever since Victor came into his life, I mean, mind you, this is the guy that he idolized since he was a kid. And on top of the idolization, he's also a guy that has the same, you know, aspect of figure skating and that same passion. And mind you, this guy is also helping him become a beggar, uh, a beggar, a better figure skater. So when you combine those, like, I guess, I don't know, those those two things. And then on top of Victor being a good coach, and just, I don't know, overall just, I guess, bringing a side out of Yuri that he didn't know he had. It's all bowled up. It's inside there. Maybe if the show was a little bit longer than 12 episodes, they, we probably could have built up a little bit more uh, tension with the relationship aspect of the show. I don't feel like it's being forced or anything. I, I can't see it. I can see why Yuri would want Victor but I don't, I don't see why he would literally open up and tell the world, like, yeah, yeah I, I want this guy. It's a great feeling to have. Like, I think that's what's going on with Yuri. He just he has a lot of questions, a lot of thoughts. And when you have that feeling, you don't want to lose that person. I've been there. I've fallen in love. And I never wanted to lose that particular feeling. I did not want to lose that girl. And, yeah, I've been there. Trust me. I know that feeling all too well. So Yuri advanced, and he's going up to the next cup or the next tournament thing, whatever, the standings, whatever it's called. And now he's got to face off his best friend or his friend from China. So I bet this one's not going to be easy. I bet this one's going to be very, very hard. And hopefully we get to see a new, like, uh, program review, whatever it is, the figure skating. Hopefully we don't get to see the same same little thing that, you know, Yuri's been doing. I Hopefully, I'm sure we're going to get a brand new uh course thing. I don't know what the hell you would call it, the programming thingies. The the dancing, the twirling. And hopefully he doesn't hit a wall this time. Come on, buddy. You can do it. I'm digging these challenges and I think that pretty much is what or I think that pretty much is what's gonna happen for the next uh, half of the show. Pretty much is all competition, competition until we get to the finale. Heck, I'm more enthralled. I wanna see more of Durio. And I want to see that showdown. And I, I'm just, uh, who's going to win? A Yuri, more than likely. <laughs> All right, guys, that about wraps up today's video. Leave me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Beats about anything I discuss, anything I miss, or anything you guys would love to talk about. Feel free to like this video or subscribe to my channel. I highly appreciate it if you do. And as always, keep peaceful. Enjoy the rest of your day. And farewell for now. Bye-bye.